Hello, my fellow Credonians, and welcome back to Let's Play Night of Ratatosk. Last time, we defeated Alice with the help of Zelos, who is kind of a douchebag. And because, you know, he trusts Loy and everything, and we're trying to kill him. <laughs> okay. And this time, we're going to be heading into the Dynasty Ruins to check out the problem with the water system, or the water, so we can travel to Asalia. Yeah. Anyway, before we start off, let's watch this skit. Alice kind of acts like a child. How old is she anyway? 18. She's that old? And that's just what she says. She could be even older. When is she going to grow up and ditch that creepy baby talk? Sounds like it really bothers you. You're a bit short on experience, so you may not know. But young ladies like Alice who flaunt their cuteness aren't generally well liked by their female peers. Oh, I see. Be that as it may, there isn't a young lady alive who hasn't reveled in her own cuteness from time to time. I'll never understand women. The women be hating on the lollies, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, 18 is lolly enough for me, apparently. No? Okay, so what you gotta do here is use the um, sorcerer's ring on that. Anyway, I got some stuff to talk about, you know, the random cutouts didn't happen that was weird anyway I think there's a yeah a scene uh, I'll talk about it after the sound of water in a dark place is really creepy really I think it's rather romantic myself you do Emil what do you think of me what do you mean? A lot of people tell me I'm too stubborn. They say I come across as too serious, too much. What do you think? Do you think I'm too much? Consider considering you're so clingy. Yeah. Um, I think you're on the skinny side, so I don't think you're too much. That sounds like something Colette would say. Th that's not what I meant. Well, whatever. I'm going to work hard to make you like me. If there's anything I should do better, just say the word. Must be exhausting being such a heartbreaker. You can't be serious. What has obviously just built up this image of me in her mind as some sort of ideal man. Oh, you're smarter than you look. you talking about? Nothing, Nothing at, all. at all, Lady Marta. I mean, who didn't see that coming? Oh yay, Marta obtained the title too much. Yes, I am not an image that you just build up. Love, the tender trap. I actually like this one. Oh, I like all the skits, so what am I saying? Uh, why is this so hard? What seems to be the trouble, Emil? Oh, it's Marta. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. Ah, love, the tender trap. Don't tease me. No girl's ever been interested in me before. I don't know the first thing about going out with someone. When dating a young lady, the greatest hurdle is choosing the perfect moment to first hold hands with her. And I'd say you pass that test with flying colors. Huh? No, I'm talking more about- My goodness, how bold. So, you wish to take the relationship to the next level. That's not what I said. Just forget it. I'll figure it out on my own. Not to worry. I highly doubt Lady Marta's wishes will come true. Now that was a spiteful move. <laughs> I actually cracked up. You know, I literally just cracked up. That was funny. Oh, sh I'll run away. Anyway, I got some. I got some awesome stories to tell. With these. Ah. Oh, anyway, recently. Um, you know, we we were in this, you know, random, um, oh, okay, thanks, you know, you can, you can stop hanging me anytime, thanks, okay. Anyway, we were in this random ass, uh, stream, you know, Getsu, okay, really? You know, we're having, we're just having a fun little stream, you know, and then all of a sudden, Sonic Blue Sky just makes up this random reference about, um, 
Uh, Zatch Bell, you know, Parko Fogore? You know who Parko Fogore is? You know, I'm gonna tell you guys what Parko Fogore is. Um, yeah. Oh, I want one of those. Yeah! Seahog! Freaking Ponage! Um... You know, we're, we're gonna get rid of the piece of shit imp. I hate the imp. It doesn't do shit. Anyway, you guys know who Paco Fogode is? I'm gonna tell you who Paco Fogode is. Yeah, once I avoid this guy. Uh, Iron Man Fogode, Invincible Fogode, Brave and Strong Fogode, He always wins the day. Oh, I love Paco Fogode. Um, not sure if I'm supposed to push this off. You know, I'm gonna leave that there for right now. Oh, I love Paco Fogode. And his other song, you know his hit single? Um, let me think a bit. Hey, hey, let's dance all day. Boing, 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 boing. God. I love Paco Fogode. Zatch Bell, man, that show is just so hilarious. I mean, it's part of my childhood. I love it, you know. I know, um... The other great shows that, you know, I really loved got cancelled because of it, but, um... That show, man, I, I really love that show. It is, it is just completely hilarious. You know, it has, it has a great sense of knowing when to be hilarious and knowing when to be serious. I think that's all we need the fire for, so we want to grab our lights back. So yeah, I, I've been watching a lot of Zatch Bell. I'm on like episode 20. I can't stop watching that crap. It's freaking awesome! Um, now, to be completely honest, I don't remember any of this place. You know, I, like, I'm gonna be completely lost in here. Especially this this one part. This one part is very tedious. You gotta go up these um, ladders. You got the... You got monsters. You got waterfalls you have to go around. It's kind of annoying. Uh, I can pretty much one shot or one combo everything, so no really worries here. That's it. But yeah, that's my one story about Zatch Bell. Uh, actually, I'm gonna look at those skills because I haven't really put on skills for a while. But yeah, I've been really crazy over Zatch Bell, and they've made so many references. Like, oh, they got like every Tales voice actor in there. Like, they got Lloyd. From, uh, Symphonia, uh, skills. They got, um, they got Arietta and Anis as partners. You know how they were enemies in Tales of the Abyss? They're partners now in Zatch Bell. I thought that was freaking hilarious. Uh, useless. Um, holy crap, we got a lot. Um, who? No, I want, I want that. Let's put that there. There. Okay. It, yeah, it, it is just really funny. Yeah, okay, we're good. And I went up that ladder, or went down this ladder for nothing because I forgot about the waterfall. Because I'm a froob. I'm a froob, man. I'm a freaking noob. I just, but it's just seriously, uh, it amuses me how many like voice actors are in that show that I just never noticed. There's uh, Steven Bloom, I think his name is, you know, who does like Makoto Shishio and a bunch of other games. He's got a really badass voice. I know he was like the main character in Bullet Storm because I watched SSOH do that game. Yeah, he's in that. Um, you got Lloyd, you got Arietta, Annis. It's just amazing. I love it. I freaking love it. There we go, we got Pathway now. Um, but yeah, that show it just has a lot of voice actors I recognize, which is awesome. I just love how they do that. Um, I'm gonna try something. I don't know if this is gonna work, but I'm gonna try it. You would think you want to put this here, but I'm gonna... Tr Actually, let's grab that chest before I forget. Uh, hey buddy. You, you want some Paco Fogode? I got a CD. No, no, we're, we're avoiding you. We need to get the longsword. 
An upgrade? Yes, it is. A long, powerful sword. Hey, it sounds like my sword. A wang. Or, ka -ching. God. I don't know how I make a dirty joke. Anyway, let's put it. Let's push it. No, wrong way! Wrong way! Oh, crap. Not the way I wanted it to go. Damn it. Oh, well. Uh. Oh. Oh, well. What I wanted to do was go the other way. Not that way. Baco Fogode doesn't. You, you don't have the boing. The boing is not with you, okay? So you just need to get out of here and die. Anyway, what I wanted the. The block to do was go over here and come right here so I could grab those chests, but it doesn't look like that's gonna happen. Which was my mistake. You know, I should have looked up this dungeon because I knew once I got to this room I was gonna be like, oh man, I don't know what the fuck to do. Because, you know, I'm, I, I suck at this room. Uh, I think it's tedious and I'd always forget about it. No. Back away. I'm running away from you. Baco Fogode doesn't approve. I may keep saying that, I'm sorry. Like, this this show, you know, I watched it as a kid, but it's changed me so much. You want to know how much this show has changed me? I'm going to tell you. Uh, it made me sing in the shower for the first time in, like, years. And it made me sing, hey, hey, let's dance all day, boing, boing. Because I love Paco Fogode. This, this episode is probably going to be named Parko Fogole, unless I forget in editing. So, uh, yeah, that's just how I roll. I probably should be trying to get all the chests, but, you know, I just, I just don't know. Let's, uh, let's change the waterways. Maybe that will somehow get that other block to move over back over there to grab those chests. If so, that would be pretty awesome. But I know where this block is going to go. Okay, the flow is water has changed. Now we got to go this way. See how bad I am at this place? Like, I've spent an entire episode in this one room. That's how bad I am. Do, 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 do. Well, the, the pretty much the dungeon is this room, to be completely honest, you know. So, um, it's actually a pretty good thing that I spent a lot of time here. Let's see if that block, like, somehow magically moved over here. Because if it... No, I didn't think so. Yeah, that was a mistake on my part. <laughs> Should have waited. Uh, I'm an idiot, so... I lost my boing. Uh, yeah. Yeah, block's gone. Oh, are you kidding me? I was supposed to change the water back? <sighs> I'm an idiot. Dun, 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 dun. I wonder if the block respawns. I'll have to go check that. Because if it does, I might just, you know, run back. Hopefully this takes me back up to where I'm supposed to go. Because if it does, I'm going to be one happy camper. Hooray, it does. Let's quickly... Can't go back down that way though, so I gotta go around again. Because I'm an idiot. This is exactly what Paco Fogode would do. He'd be an idiot. Except he would have a bunch of girls after him, and I'm, you know, I'm a, I'm a lonely boy. I don't have a girl. I've only dated like once, like one girl in my entire life because, you know, I'm not that popular. <laughs> I'm not really afraid to admit it, you know, because it's not that huge of a deal, but... I don't know, I just, you know, I never had a girl. <laughs> oh well. So if that block responds, we'll be coming back for... That... Leather cape. Can anyone equip it? Yeah, let's go ahead and put it on a meal. A meal. Uh. Ooh, we got a thunder cape. 
increases resistance to water. Ooh. You know, let's have that on him. And sure, we'll give her the leather cape. She needs a cape. Every main character needs a cape. And this is it. This is pretty much... Okay, scene. Mm. 